uh, nice quiet day off for me today. So yeah, didn't do much. Well, when somebody is at a home all day and they say I haven't done much, um, and their house is clean, it still says I haven't done much, but the house is clean. You know, <laughs> turn this turn this light on now. There we go. What have you guys been up to? So I did not much, which was housework. Uh, took both for a walk today. Um, so I do have, I have quite a bit of footage. So I'll put the sunnies on and you do get some footage of the me walking around the park with him with the sunnies on. Um, yeah. So you will get a fair amount of that because I'm not going to do much talking. Talking. I thought I'll, I'll let, the, that, let that video just give you another place to be today. I will admit though, today I was naughty. I um, I ordered uh, my custom, my next, my Egypt custom uh, from Dye Moon Shop today. <laughs> Whoops. It's, it's, <laughs> okay, sorry guys, but when I say this, it's only a 60 by 80, so it's not very big at all. Um, and I've got a strange feeling I might have to go bigger. But let's see how this one goes first. I know Diamond Shop do, do, do good work and Reggie is, um, you know, he's, he gave me a few options there with uh, different slight variations from the original two, ones where he's actually altered slightly, which I've actually gone with one of his alterations. Normally um, I'll muck around the pitch with a pitch myself before I send it through. Um, but yeah, so uh, yeah, I uh, ordered another diamond painting. So, well, I don't have a stash, but so I've got three diamond paintings on order. And um, the custom that I got from Diamond is the Egypt one, which is basically it's one on my home screen on my phone. Um, but this is the one that I will be giving away to my thousand subscriber when I do the thousand subscriber giveaways. So keep an eye out for that one. Um, I have mentioned it previously and yeah, so we'll see how, what happens and how that goes because it's, yeah. But anyway, comments that, I've comments that I've got from yesterday's um, Brittany, I saw you post a video, got, got, got excited, can't wait to see how your blank one is coming along. Yeah, that's another night, yeah. I think tomorrow night I'll work on the blank one. So yeah. Um, Tracy, so Tracy's turning around, so, oh my God, never seen the city that quiet before. You can actually walk without getting bumped, bumped into. So Tracy actually does know Perth, so yeah, the city, it's... That was a Saturday, so it was reasonably quiet. Hang on. Brief interruption there. Nathan's come into the kitchen. Um, but yes, it was a it was a Saturday. So Saturdays are quieter than normal. Um, but yeah, that was what it was like. And um, so, Anna, loved your video. Where were you? Was that a mall you were in at the beginning? The old cast. Gold car that passed through was beautiful, yep. <laughs> I didn't realise in Australia you drive on the wrong side of the street compared to the US. Yep, okay, so we had the correct side of the road is the left side of the road. Um, <laughs> in Australia anyway. So Anna, where we are is Perth, um, the city of Western Australia. And the where we, we were, you uh, where the video started. I was actually, <laughs> I was actually inside the lobby area of where I work, and the bit where you, I look up is inside where I come from. So yeah, that was um, outside of outside of our work. You have all these little bars and that that you can go to um, for drinks after work because you can't have drinks while you're while you're working. You're not allowed in, in the building when you're under the effect of any alcohol whatsoever yeah. whatsoever so so that's yeah it was in the in my work building just as you leave um 
Terrell has this, it's like virtually virtual reality glasses you can use with your phones. Yep. Yeah. I do like them. Um, the only thing is that because I bounce when I walk, <laughs> so does my head, which then means so do my sunglasses. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, that's quite a, an amusing way to go up. Um, Tazzy, I'm listening to you while trying to make my sharp tapestry needles blunt. Sent the wrong type, brought eight weeks ago and they've increased in price. 600%. Holy cow. Holy cow, 600% increase. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, so that's just, oh, it's only one day's worth of comments, which is really nice. Nice little amount of comments to catch up on. Um, yeah, just standard work. What I will do is just enjoy the video. You hear me talking to Bo, you hear me talking a bit to you as well, so that you can get a little bit of what's going on. There was no pink and greys. I took my phone with me so I could take some pictures of pink and greys, but there was no pink and greys. I could hear them, but I couldn't see them. Um, so yeah, just to enjoy the little bit of a walk that I take you on around the park, a little bit of bow, a little bit of just looking up in the trees and enjoying the fact that it is now autumn and we are starting to have the changing of the leaves. Um, for some of the deciduous trees around us. Is it deciduous? The ones that lose their leaves? Yeah, I think that's them. Um, yeah, leave me a comment. How's your day going? What have you been up to? Of course, hit the thumbs up, the thumbs down. Subscribe and hit the bell to be notified of uh, next time I do uh, an upload. And uh, I'll catch you later. And, for, and bye for now. And enjoy the video. We ready? We ready? Good boy, come on. Come on. This way, you know which way we go. Come on, buddy. Uh -uh. Sit. You are eager. <laughs> you are, aren't you? Okay, good boy. Here in a pink and grave. Too many crows. Come on. Well, it's autumn now. Look at these leaves finally falling. mind the middle of May which is uh, the middle of autumn it's taken a while to get to this stage and it's still warm what are you doing Bo? couple of birds around not many I don't know where the pink and greys are though Now, 
need for you to be in. Come on. Come on. I know they're your favourite bushes there. Where are you? Okay, hang on. What is the... 27, 28 degrees. Come on, boy. It was sniff and sniff and sniff and sniff those bushes. Bo, come on. Let's see if I can get... Building trucks that are in the development, you can hear. Oh, this is a lot of quiet. Come on, buddy. The Indians around here, they don't like dogs. What are you doing? Come on. Hey. Come on. You know the way. Hey, you know the way, don't you? Now let's get lost in these bushes, shall we? Not this time. Oh. Yeah, well we have a lot of Indians in our neighbourhood and um, a lot of ladies, they don't like dogs. And you can see that they don't like, they're scared of them. So if I am actually anywhere near a group, uh, uh, well, anywhere near them, I'll actually put Bo on the lead and make him sit so that uh, they can walk past and without any worry. Same as dogs. He goes straight on the lead when it's a dog because I don't know what that other dog's like. And if somebody else has got a dog on a lead, it's numerous reasons for it. And one is um, behaviour of the dog. But the other, which is more to me, is as soon as a dog's on a lead, because it hasn't had the freedom and know it can respond, it's very defensive. That's the way I interpret it anyway. So by putting my dog on a lead, he is at the same level as another dog on a lead. And yet again, if I'm... Um, if I'm walking by on a lead and I see someone walking their dog that's not on a lead, I will still make both sit and wait. Come on, buddy, how many times? Yeah. No pink and grey today. You're drooling. Getting thirsty? Good boy, go on. Where are they? Come on, where are you? Not up there today. Where are you? They're up there somewhere, I can't see them. I think that's a... no, that's... 
Again. Hey, bye, bye, bye. Come here. I'm going to the bin. Mm, we don't normally go this way. Ah, ah, ah. Sit. Mind we go and let's go this way for the bin. Okay, come on, back we go. Come on, come on. He's, he's pulling me basically to get me moving to leave. Now he's like tuckered. This is a good thing. Hey, buddy. I don't know how much glare that sun's giving you. He's too hot and bothered to run anywhere now. Fine. He would run if I had to make him. Or if he wanted to, he'd run. Hey buddy. Come on. This is this his sniff? He loves this spot. So many dogs must come by this corner. Wait, wait. Come on. Bye. Come on. Come on, beautiful. Here. Come on. Come here. Come on. Gonna sit. Sit at the curb. Come on. Good boy, come on. Come on. I'll be wearing snake signs. Come on, buddy. Should have walked them earlier today, but I don't know how to look. Come on, where are you? He is a shocker for weighing on stuff. Come on. <laughs> Big drink of water when you get home, isn't it? Hey? Big drink of water when we get home. <laughs> we have such tiny, tiny backyards, which is why we have all these massive park areas, barbecue areas and that, so that you do, you get out of your home. Hello, <laughs> come on. 
<laughs> He's ready to home. Come on. Come on. Hey, 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 back here. Come on. Because there's no lip, the curb is different set up here. Sit. That's it. We're ready to go home? Good boy, come on. He knows where he's going. 